Uh, good morning, guys. It's Monday. Welcome to another vlog. With me, your host, as always, John and Um Now, before I start the vlog, just gotta let you know, guys. I found out a friend of mine was who was quite ill um, passed away on Saturday. So it's a bit of a difficult time for the vlog. Like, it's another way of saying I just gotta come out and say it, I gotta talk. Because uh, the best way with these sort of things is to talk about it. And now he was part of my Padgett football team. I'm not going to name names and stuff out of respect for the family and stuff. But he was a good friend of mine, knew him a long time, 10 years. Went to the same uni as me as well. And yeah, it's just a difficult time for all of us. Um, I'm probably going to go to the funeral. Um, but yeah, I'm just coming to terms with it still. And remembering some of the times we had in the same team. Now... When I started Padre Football, um, we were in the same team for the first five years. And then I moved to the team I was at, I was at last year, like for the last four years. Um, and then I moved back this year. Like, you know about the whole story, but I moved back to my old team. We were playing week in, week out together, training. Um, then, maybe like two months ago or a month ago, he, he had a bit of a cold and he didn't come football. And then he, he was ill for a bit, and then he got better. He thought it was alright. And then, maybe a week ago, he was in hospital, ICU, at the Royal Free. And turned out he had pneumonia the whole time. And we find, found out the bad news on Saturday. So, there's no other way I can say it other, other than saying it, you know. Um, I don't know. It's a difficult time. But I was trying to work out how to say it to you guys, because... I tried yesterday, but I just couldn't face it. I was meant to go training as well. I couldn't do that. So I couldn't talk to you guys. I just had to be with the fact we had to be at home, you know, chill. Just come to terms with it, because it's difficult. Because I, I saw him two weeks ago. He was fine. He had a bit of a cold. They thought it was a chest infection, you know. This is just... And then I went through the, all the stages of grieving. I don't know what order it happens, but it happens different to everyone. Like, at first, it was just disbelief. And, like... You know, what's the word? I couldn't believe it happened. Like, you know, you, you're like, no, no way. You know, the obvious things. No, what? How can how can this be? You know, and then you get, you think of all the times, and then you it's sad and happy, like all the happy times, and then you, you're sad because you never see him again. And then I felt like a bit of anger as well. Like, you know, you feel like. I don't know, you feel guilty as well, like, how can you enjoy anything again, like, without feeling a bit of guilt, you know, I, I shouldn't be like that, really, but the thanks, thanks to you guys, I'm getting through it, thanks to everyone, and we're going to show support at the funeral, because that's what we do with teammates, but, um, yeah, I'm going to show you one of the trophies we won together as players, this is, uh, I don't know if you can see, this is WFA Championship winners 2008-09. That was the second time we won it. I can't find the first one at the minute, but yeah, this is like one of the medals we won. Yeah, so this was one of the seasons we won the league together. He was our goalkeeper, great goalkeeper, always. Shout, shout out to, to the family, you know. Staying strong, but trying to. I'm just grateful that I knew him. Sad, sad times for the vlog. You know, I haven't had much of these type of vlogs where I've had to talk about the passing of a friend. But, um, yeah. Just gotta get on. Gotta move on. keep making videos. Keep doing what I'm doing, don't, you know. But this kind of thing, it just like, it shakes you, innit? wakes you up, it's just like, you know, there's no words, um, for anyone who's going through anything like, any sort of loss, friend or family or whatever, it's just, it's not easy, coming to terms with it, realising it, and carrying on it, getting back to the routine, but, you know, they say if you just get back to the routine it helps, but you need to take a moment always, remember the positive things, because they're all positive, you know, Great friend of mine. 
like I said, we were at the same uni. Um, yeah, I'm not going to stop talking about that. Try and move on. God, but not forgotten, you know. Just because I don't talk about it, with, obviously I'm going to talk about it now and then. That's it, you know. Try and get back to what I do best on the blog. But I just thought I needed to talk to someone, to you guys. Let you guys know what's going on with me if I'm a bit struggling a bit creatively with the videos. If I hadn't made one in a few days. I was supposed to go training like I said but I didn't because I couldn't face it. But next week I will be and I'll be filming that. And I've got another another few videos planned this week. Some new ideas. Um, pro I might want to dig out more old trophies like this in remembrance you know. Remembering how far I've come in the sport. And as we get towards Christmas, it's got to be a, a lot more excitement going on in these vlogs. We'll have so much more going on. New Year, got some vlogs planned for the New Year. And covering how far I've come in this vlog, what's gone on this year, good and bad. And most of all, keep it real. Um, yeah. See ya. See you soon. Don't go too far. As always, like, share, comment, subscribe. Drop something in the comments. So, some uh, advice for other other people watching about loss and things like that, or something more positive. Something, anything. Drop a comment, a like, share, subscribe. As always, thank you. Yeah. So anyway, guys, here's a little clip that I found the other day of one of my famous, one of my favourite vloggers, my inspirations on the vlog, what, for doing the vlog, um, and it might help with the, the situation I'm going through, it helped me so it might help you guys if you're going through something similar, but anyway here it is, it's from the other day, I didn't actually use it the other day but now it seems relevant. Just know, guys, if you're going through a hard shit right now, anything bad happens in your life, just know that everyone goes through it. All of us have hard shit that happens. Some shit might be a little bit more shittier. But in the grand scheme of things, hopefully you guys have water. You have a bed to sleep in, you have a beautiful girlfriend, a boyfriend, or you have a mom and a dad. And if you don't, just keep on pushing. Keep doing you, you know, because shit's gonna happen. I feel really bad. I will be